St. Thomas Aquinas Seminary is a house of traditional priestly formation. From the original call that led the young man to enter the seminary to that call's fulfillment at his priestly ordination. Our mission at the seminary is the formation of holy priests, a priest who is another Christ. The liturgy, prayer life, studies, work, and recreation all harmonize to make the seminarian like unto Christ. The liturgy holds the prominent place in the future priest's life. This includes daily mass, the very soul of the priest's life solemn high mass on Sundays and feast days, and the divine office chanted in community. Seminarians are specifically designated and tasked to prepare these sacred ceremonies with great attention and devotion. Seminarians gather in the chapel for daily rosary, holy hour, and stations of the cross. In addition to prayer in common, Silence is essential for a fruitful interior life. Silence is the very atmosphere of the seminary. It is the necessary condition for union with God and intellectual studies. Direction in the seminarian's spiritual life comes primarily from their spiritual director, and every evening the rector gives all the seminarians a spiritual conference. A sound formation in philosophy and theology is essential to the future ministry of the priest. The seminary program extends over seven years, beginning with the Year of Humanities, in which the seminarian shores up the foundation of his liberal arts education and adjusts to seminary life. Then follows the Year of Spirituality, a year introduced by our founder, Archbishop Lefebvre, to provide the future priest with a formation in mystical and ascetical theology, which will serve him the rest of his life. Next are the two years of philosophy, in which the perennial wisdom of Aristotle and St. Thomas Aquinas form the mind of the young aspirant. Finally, there are three years of theology, during which the seminarian takes on many of the duties of the priesthood, including the daily recitation of the divine office and preaching. Recreation also plays an important role in the life of the seminary. Time is set aside each day in the afternoon and evening to give our seminarians a chance to refresh the mind and exercise. A longer period of recreation on Sunday and Wednesday afternoons is the preferred time for many activities, ranging from sports and exercise to a reinvigorating hike or walk. As part of our formation, household jobs, like waiting on tables and washing dishes, are performed on a weekly rotation by all seminarians, instilling in them both a spirit of diligence and humility. In addition to these weekly jobs, seminarians have a more regular department job, such as sacristy, landscaping, library, scola, house cleaning, and art. These jobs prepare the seminarian for roles of leadership and responsibility, as well as ensuring the smooth running of the seminary. Our brothers, as the guardian angels of our community, aid and direct the seminarians in much of this work. They especially assist in administrative duties. Running the kitchen, woodworking, and taking care of the livestock on our farm. The goal of the seminary is the formation and training of young men to be a priest in the model of Christ, preparing them to carry the torch of tradition throughout the world 
in order to restore all things in Christ, following the example of our founder. Tradiri quod et accepi. I have passed on what I have received.